Well, I thought I was done with Rogue Company, but I guess not. Um, today is Sunday, and it's the day after yesterday in which I drank. I haven't drank today. I'm not going to drink today. I just don't want to. Which is good. I want to not want to. Um, But I shouldn't have drank last night either. I gotta... I honestly, like... I'm gonna have to stop. Um, Just so much money to drink, bro. Not that I'm, like, going for broke. I'm still able to save a lot of money. Um, But if I keep it up, then I know what I'm going to... If I keep up drinking, I know I'm going to, like... This is what happened last time, because it was so much money to just just, uh, drink beer. So then I would buy, like, a handle of whiskey. And then... Now I have a hand... And then I have a handle of whiskey, and I don't need that. I do not need to have that much alcohol. (sighs) So, I can't believe it's Rogue Company again, dude. I thought we were done with this one. How many games of Rogue Company did I fucking play? Man, we're getting towards the end of the journal, guys. It's at 90. 90 will be the end of it. Unless there's a reason to continue, but probably not. Because I don't want to play that. Unless I just get back into video games, which I don't really foresee happening, then if I get back into video games, then I could see myself just recording what I play. But I don't really feel like going back and playing, uh, you know, I don't really feel like going back and playing a ton of Rocket League or any of those games. I don't want to completely learn a new game. Like, I don't want to, like, I don't want to get into League of Legends now, you know, and shit, I don't know, there's just no games that really look that great to me, and there's probably some that are going to be really cool, don't get me wrong, it's just, right now, I don't really foresee it happening, but that does not mean that it won't happen, you know, sometimes, you just gotta see, but I like, um, but right now I'm just kind of waiting to also it doesn't help that I've bought in some new clothes recently that doesn't help with my spending either but I rarely buy clothes so it's like when I do buy clothes I kind of just like buy a bunch unfortunately cause but I do need to update some shit you know, you know how it is I'm wearing the same clothes for five years, probably. And I mean, if it, if it ain't broke, I should probably stop playing with my keys. If it ain't broke, you know. Oh, that's why we're getting dogged. We're down a fucking person. Which, there's nothing wrong with wearing the same clothes, but a lot of my shirts are, like, stained. <laughs> that's, that's, like, they're, like, I'm wearing a white t-shirt right now, and since... I do all this walking, and I wear a backpack. It's a black backpack. So my armpits stain, like my armpits sweat, and then the backpack rubs off on the armpits, and then now I just have, like, black armpits that look kind of gross. So it's like, this shirt's going to have to go. These jean shorts that I'm wearing have coffee stains and, like, cigarette ash stains on them. So those are going to have to... Uh, well, these are fine. I'm going to keep these. I'm going to keep these until they rip. I like these. Uh, plus, they're like the only... nice. <laughs> they're my only nice shorts. <laughs> I 
And then another thing about laundry, like, not laundry, but clothes, it's kind of like, do I really need a bunch of new clothes? Because I only really get to wear outfits a couple times a week because of work, you know. It's like I pretty much wear the same clothes every week because I only have a day or two off. Like, this was my only full day off that I had this week, and then next week I'll have two days off. But then the week after that, I'll only have one full day off again. So it's like, well, how many outfits do you really need to wear? But, I don't know, I have a ton of fucking old clothes. So it's kind of just like, you know, it's the process of phasing out some of your clothes, keeping other ones... And then phasing out more, and then... I mean, this is such a stupid fucking topic. Why am I even talking about phasing out clothes? But honestly, for me, it's kind of, like, hard to get rid of my clothes. Just because they've been with me for so long. It's kind of like shoes, you know? Like, I'll wear the same pair of shoes every day for a year. And then when it's time to get new shoes, it's like, damn. I think it's weird that I get attached to these, like, inanimate objects. I can't be the only one, though. Well, it's not like I talk to them and shit, but it's like, you know, these shoes will have been with me for a year, and in that year we will have, I say we like a fucking weirdo, in a year we, the shoes they are, will have traveled so much. I mean, shoot, today I walked eight miles in these shoes, which honestly, I might have to get, I mean, these shoes are probably going to rip up faster than my other shoes, because I walk so much in them. My Doc Martens. I love my Docs. I've won, I've bought in three of these pairs of shoes, because they always rip up. <coughs> but it's not the leather Docs. Uh, I don't think I'd look very good in those ones. They're these suede ones. Um, I don't even know if they're suede. I don't know. I buy them on Amazon. Also, the problem is I do like getting new clothes. Like, I feel like it's weird when people say they don't like getting new clothes. It's like, really? You don't? The only thing is I try to get clothes that are going to last. I don't want to get, like... Like, if anybody knows what Primark is. Like, I don't want to go shopping at Primark, because after, like, two what, like two wares, they're going to rip. Or uh, they're going to end up looking see-through. But whatever. I like clothes. I've always liked sh- club shopping for clothes. I just, um, I just like expensive clothes. <laughs> so, so I tend to not buy clothes that often. Because... Well, not expensive clothes. I'm not buying, like, Gucci or shit like that. But, I mean, like, Levi's are pretty expensive for me. Or I think they're on the more expensive side. So, I like Levi's. I just bought two pairs of Levi's jeans. So that's why I'm kind of on this topic. But clothes, man. I love socks. And I wear the hell out of my socks. So many of my socks have holes in them. This is stupid. What else can I talk about? But right now I'm waiting to... uh... (sighs) That eight mile walk, man. That was a good walk. Eight miles. And... Now I'm waiting to go to, I'm going to go to a few groceries, so, just sandwich stuff. Man. I think it's kind of funny. My friend last night, I said we were playing games. This is, this is something he says to me. And, like, I find it, like, things that I, I I think it takes me a second to react to things that people say that sound weird. And 
this was one of those things that it wasn't weird. It was just, yeah, no, it was, I think it was an odd, like, whatever. I'm just going to. So he's talking about, have I thought about my best man speech at all? Um, and I was like, yeah, I mean, don't expect it to be, like, the best speech ever. I mean, I was like, yeah, something like that, you know. He was like, well, you know, the best best man speeches are the ones where you know a bit about the groom and the bride. Uh, I was like, well, I don't know anything about it. Oh, shit. Well, I'll just cut a little bit of that out. I'll make a little note. I'll just... I'll bleep the name, because, <laughs> um, but I'm like, yeah, I, I mean, but maybe I, I'm not, I was never invited, like, that, 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 that just blows my mind, it's like, you never invited me to go hang out with you guys, so why should I know anything about this person? Probably seen. Okay. Like, ugh. Why? Why? Like, why is it on me to? I don't know. That, that's just like a, like now I'm reacting to it. Cause I'm like, well, whatever, dude. I don't know. I just told him, don't don't expect the best man speech to be like to make the night. Cause I'm put effort into it. Don't get me wrong, but it's not gonna be like the best man speech to. I shouldn't even be the best man, dude. I don't even. I don't even know her. I know him, but I was never invited. I was never invited out with him. When I was back in Pennsylvania, I had to, like, set everything up. Like, it's so stupid, man. It is just so stupid. But... I don't know. I said you two can come to the shy, and I'll clear my name, and then I'll know her a little bit. But I'm not going back to Pennsylvania for to hang out with them. Basically, I don't care how if that sounds bad or mean or whatever. I'm not that. That's I'm not spending the money to go to PA just to hang out with them. So, there is that. Because if I go to Pennsylvania, the only place I want to go is Philly. <laughs> he doesn't live in Philly. So, like, whatever. These people, man. And I really don't think that's me being a bad friend, you know? I really think that's just them being weird whatever whatever it's a year away I can put it off for a while for a year ask one of my other friends see what they think about it just to get like uh, cause I don't know if I'm looking for like just like shoot um, 
not positive reinforcement. That's definitely not the phrase I'm looking for. Confirmation bias, maybe? I don't know, that sounds right. Maybe I'm just looking for someone to align their beliefs with mine, or just to tell me I'm right. But but I think I'm right, and I don't even... Even if, like, someone said, no, nah, you're in the wrong here, I think I'd be like, I really don't think I am, dude. <laughs> so, yeah, I guess that is confirmation bias or something like that, right? Maybe I just have socially stupid friends. That could be it, too. I don't know. I just thought that was a weird thing to say. It's like, well, you know, you're supposed to know us both. Well, I was really never invited to know you both. <laughs> so, um, what do you want me to do, buddy? What do you want me to do, buddy? Thank God this game's probably almost over. Thank God. Fucking hate Rogue Company. I really hope this is the last Rogue Company. I thought the last Rogue Company happened a while ago. But it keeps popping back up like herpes. Alright. Well, later gang. GG's.